Hello and welcome to another reading from the book That I May Know Him, a daily devotional. Today's reading is entitled Christ the Good Shepherd, February 15th. I am the good shepherd and know my sheep and am known of mine. As the Father knoweth me, even so know I the Father, and I lay down my life for the sheep. John 10, verses 14 and 15. Jesus says, I know my sheep. Let us consider the statement. We are known by God before we receive him. I know my sheep. How do souls become Christ's sheep? By choosing to receive him. But Christ had first chosen them. He knew everyone who would respond to his drawing, and he knew everyone who would be inclined to receive him, but who, through popular opposing influences, would turn from him. John says to all, Behold the Lamb of God, which taketh away the sin of the world. John 1, 29. Those who heard the voice and did behold Jesus as the Lamb of God believed in him and became his property from their own choice. But their choosing of Christ was in response to his drawing. The love of Jesus was expressed to us before we loved him. To Jesus the whole human family is entrusted, as the flocks of sheep are entrusted to a shepherd. These sheep and lambs are to be tended with pastoral care. They will be guarded by the faithful chief shepherd under the care of faithful under-shepherds, and if they will obey the voice of the chief shepherd, they will not be left to be devoured by wolves. Jesus says, My sheep hear my voice, and they follow me. John 10.27 The shepherd of Israel does not drive his flock, but he leads them. His attitude is wholly one of invitation. My sheep hear my voice. If we are indeed sons and daughters of God, we not only hear but recognize the voice above all others. We appreciate the words of Christ. We distinguish the truth as it is in Jesus from all error, and the truth refreshes the soul and fills it with gladness. The beautiful illustration in Revelation 7 is a pastoral symbol. They shall hunger no more, neither thirst any more, neither shall the sun light on them, nor any heat. For the Lamb which is in the midst of the throne shall feed them, and shall lead them unto living fountains of waters. Revelation 7 verses 16 and 17 Thank you for listening today. Be sure to join me tomorrow for another reading from the book that I may know him. Be encouraged.